Hey Chad here for the AI Content Dojo. In this video, I want to introduce you to Persona SEO. What is Persona SEO? Well, it's a book, but really what I'm trying to do is coin a new movement, start something where I'm explaining a practice of connecting a topic to your reader with a deep understanding of what the reader requires from the topic and what you know about your reader. So the key to Persona SEO is knowing your reader so in depth that you can basically pull topic ideas kind of out of their story. And this book is gonna show you how to do that. Uh, and it's gonna show you how to do it with AI tools like Phrase, Shortly AI, and Jarvis. Uh, it sort of has the mantra, let me go down just a little bit. It sort of has the mantra of solve your reader's problems, solve your Google problems. And what that really kind of means is that when you write for a person, for your reader specifically, for what they need, depending on what it is they're searching about and, and what you know of them and what you, you know of the topic, of course, then Google is going to reward you for that. You know, you're going to have your own unique content that's designed and built specifically for a human, and it's going to resonate with them, and Google loves that. It doesn't mean that there's no SEO, right? Optimization still is something that what you would do. It's something that you would do after you're done making sure that your content completely serves your reader, right? And by the way, phrase will make that a really easy thing to do you know, afterwards when you do your, your topic score and try and get your score higher to make sure you got all the keywords in there in there and sort of the content gap analysis between the top ranking stuff and yours. But why persona SEO now? Well, AI. <laughs> yeah, the unfortunately it's the AI writing tools just like shortly in and Jarvis and Phrase coming up, right? Um, the flood of mediocre content is here. I was gonna say coming, but it's already here. Uh, you know, and it's only gonna continue to get worse. It's gonna continue to rise. I like the analogy of a flood and a rise because essentially what's gonna happen is it's going to allow a mediocre writer to come up with content that would be beyond their, necess their their skills necessarily. And so it's gonna raise that quality bar just a little bit. And there's gonna be so much of that content that Google is going to just have to figure out what it determines is better quality. And my guess is that the people who can stay relevant by using techniques such as Persona SEO will stay ahead of the pack. And so as that sort of mediocre content kind of starts getting struck from any kind of rankings, if it even ever ranks at all, your unique content, because you're following the Persona SEO practices, will be there to fill that void. Yours will rank, because like I said, Google loves it when you do something good for your reader. And that's exactly kind of what we shoot for with the Persona SEO practice. Now the book dives deep into what the Persona SEO is, how to implement it into your workflows and kind of how to kind of get the most from it. I'm just kind of scrolling, but I'm gonna go back up to the top here. Um, there is a companion video to the book as well. And that is essentially where I will show you how to do the things that the book discusses. Uh, that way, if you're the type of person who needs to see it in action, you'll be able to do that. Plus, in the in the video, I do have some bonus materials where I explain how to do some uh, extra above and beyond type of things uh, using phrase, shortly AI, and Jarvis as well. So you can get to this page. It's on the, it's on the AI Content Dojo website. But if you go to personaseo.com, I don't know if you can see this over here in my notes, but if you, if you go to personaseo.com, you'll get redirected to this page where you can pick up a copy of the book. Now you can see that I say, ignore keyword research. Yeah, I dropped a bomb, didn't I? Now, obviously that's the big advice that's going around right now. The better you can do keyword research, the better you'll, your website will be, right? 
But there's a lot of people who don't like to do keyword research. You know, it's, it's annoying, it's time consuming for them. They just don't like it. And then if, if so many gurus and everybody out there is telling them that, well, if you don't do keyword research, then your project is doomed to fail, uh, then they're going to be pretty disappointed and, and still try to do it even though they don't want to. And I'm here to say that you don't have to do keyword research if you don't want to. If you follow the Persona SEO principles, you'll still have success even though you don't do keyword research. The AI Content Dojo itself I do zero keyword research and one could say I'm doing very, very well with it. Um, but that doesn't mean that you can't, if you want to, if you, if you're skilled at keyword research, uh, and you enjoy it, then combining keyword research with persona SEO and uh, plus SEO, you know, like the search engine optimization of like phrase or something like that would be a killer technique if you want to really, you know, you know, blow away the competition, that technique would not only give you the ability to give Google what it wants, but you would be giving the reader what they want. And uh, yeah, that at that point, you're just talking just like pure win. And so if you, if you are able to do that, then more power to you. The ignore keyword research, I'm just trying to light a match a little bit. <laughs> so, you know, don't kill me. I'm, I'm just trying to say that, you know, keyword research is that thing that keeps getting told, you got to do this, you got to do this, you got to do this. The AI Content Dojo is proof that you don't have to. You can still be successful without it as long as you follow some good principles to make sure that your content is quality. What I really, really want to get from this is that Persona SEO is a really good way to make sure that your content can stand out and kind of future proof yourself because as these AI tools flood the market with more content, there's going to there's gonna need to be a way to stand out. And I think that this is the way to do it. And if you agree or if you're interested and intrigued in the concept, then go over to PersonaSEO.com and pick up a copy of this book. Grab the video bundle if you want to see it in action. And uh, I would really appreciate that. That would support the dojo and me creating more guides and tools and all kinds of stuff going forward as I try to make Persona SEO an industry standard. And uh, yeah, join me. If you want to help out, spread the word. I would really appreciate that. And until next time, take care.